Howdy, howdy, y'all. It's Sir Cowpoke, and welcome on back to Hogwarts Legacy. If you haven't catched our last ride, go check that out, because we were picking up some beasts and everything in the last round, and uh, we're actually out in our new little world. That's where we're starting off right here. This is our little, like, animal safe haven place and stuff where you can catch, you know, mystical beast and put them in here. And say, oh, look, the other one way over there is playing with the ball. In the wall. It's, see, that thing's just cute. I mean, this is just all just adorableness and awesomeness. But anyways, anyways, we're doing a different adventure today, though. We're going to be continuing the main story and whatnot. But first, we have a couple side things to knock out. First, just a couple of the ones. Not a lot. And uh, sell some stuff and everything. And then uh, probably pick up a couple of you magic beasts. But our main quest today is we're going to go take uh, go to Sebastian's hometown and see his sister. That's what we're doing today. So... But for the delay, let's get to riding, y'all. Peace. All right. Wah! Place is awesome. Don't fall down. It hurts. Bum, bum, bum. Oh, look at that one. They're just playing. Oh, they're, oh, they're both playing. They're both playing. Do I, do I have anything to collect? Let me check to see if I have anything to collect. Uh, oh, wait. I need, to, I, need a, I need to groom you. Wait, wait, wait. What? No oh, shit, wrong button. I'll look after you. Get the booty back out there. I need to brush you. That's what I needed to do. Um, interact on goods. How are we doing over here? Anything I can uh, pick up? Nope, not yet. I think I don't. I think we're good. I think we're good on everything. Where's my hippogriff? There you are. There's my good boy hippogriff. Be my good hippogriff. Okay, we still got some time on a lot of these things. So, we'll come back to y'all later. Have a great time. Have a good one. Easy, shall see y'all later. It's in um and everything. But have fun. Have fun, y'all. Have fun. All right. And we need to do this. This will be more useful when I have something to identify. Oh, we got a bunch of stuff to identify. I guess I already did it. ID. What's up? This many plants here before. Oh yeah, we got we got plenty. We got plenty of plants. Anyways, we need to go to uh, the first bolt. It's going to be Hogsmeade at the Three Broomsticks. That's our first one. Hogsmeade, the Three Broomsticks, because uh, that's the one she wants to talk to us about. Yes, yes. Sometimes it seems all roads lead to Hogsmeade. Everything goes to Hogsmeade. Damn thing still pops up. If anyone ever knew how to keep. Um. That's that. Hogsmeade. Nope. Oh, Hogsmeade is there. Right? Yes. Hey! Glad you came. I'm here. What's up? Hello, what Sorona. I received your owl. How are you? Hello, my friend. Did you ever find Lord Gog? Yeah, I did. I did, oh, thank you. We had a good conversation. Yeah, we did. He sends you his best. Glad to hear it. I shan't ask for details of your little chat, and I'll refrain from telling you to be careful yet again. But I hope you will be, whatever your plans. <laughs> I, of course. Your owl mentioned you're needing my help with something? I yes. do. I thought you might be just the person to do a favor for my friend Dorothy Sprottle in Upper Hogsfield. Hmm. Yeah. I don't believe I've met Mrs. Sprottle. She's lovely. Her late husband, Aidan, was a friend of my father's. In fact, I'd stay with Dot and Aidan the summers I waited tables here as a student. Mm. I've seen her a few times since Aidan passed, but the pub's been so busy lately, I've not been as attentive as I'd have liked. I wonder Aww. if you might pop in and see her. I can pop in. She may need some help collecting ingredients for her supply of Wiganweld potion. And you could retrieve something of mine in the process. A box, um, full of old letters and such. <laughs> why, 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 why are you sounding? Sounds kind of nervous about that. Why does Mrs. Sprottle keep a supply of Wiganwell potion on hand? Dot's a skilled potioner. She's been supplying traveling vendors with Wiganwell potion, an ordinary precaution that has, unfortunately, become a necessity. What with Ranrock's loyalists disrupting the trade routes. Yeah, true, true. Why did Mr. and Mrs. Sprottle have your box of letters after all this time? It's one of a few that I had when I was young. 
Dot found it when she was clearing out a closet. Can't imagine what's in there. Probably terribly theatrical. The ramblings of a teenage witch and her friends. You're welcome to take a peek inside, if you do find it. To be honest, I'd imagine it contains some lovely memories. <laughs> I'll try you know to what? go and see her when I can. I might look at it. It would mean the world to me and to Dorothy. Aiden was bringing the box of letters to me when he was taken ill. Aww. Doc can tell you where he might have dropped it. Sure, I can do that. You'll we can find do that a just north of Hogsmeade. Sure. Please do give Dot my love. I will. Yeah, no problem. I can do that. All right, let's get moving. Shouldn't be too far off. Yeah, not too bad. As soon as we get out of town, that is. What? There's another one right there. Who are you? I'll pick you up late. Now let's grab it now. I'm gonna forget. You'll see it was a mistake parting ways with me. Sir, is everything all right? How yeah. kind of you to ask. The name's Ackley Barnes. And Howdy. no, it is not. I'm plotting a sort of revenge against my ex-business partner, a oh, conniving dang. fiend by the name of Alfred Lawley. He oh. cut me out of our herbology supply business just as we were getting started. Hm. Said I was too volatile to work with. I'll Jeez. show him volatile. <laughs> that must have been frustrating for you. Yes, yes it was. Terribly. I'm simply Terribly. passionate about my work. Supercilious fool. He's passionate about things too. As I intend to remind him by relieving him of his prized possession. A venomous tentacular he's grown from a seedling that was to be the keystone of our business venture. I can't get yeah. anywhere near it with Ruth Singer watching me like an augury. Lawley's doing, no doubt. But no one would suspect a student. Hmm. I don't want to steal How shit. How would you feel about committing some grand plant last day? Uh, I'm not very comfortable I'm not with this. sure this is something a student should be doing on your behalf. Oh, it's nothing. And he deserves it. Trust me. You'll be in and out of there in no time. Uh, I'll find another. Very well. I'll see what I can do. Excellent. I shall be right here. All I ask is that you bring me the venomous tentacular. I'll find Remember, a different way, but I, ain't, I don't want to steal anything. Tentacular. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I ain't gonna. I don't want to steal stuff. No, we're not Slytherins. We're Gryffindors. We are Gryffindors for Nindy. That's the one I'm on. All right. Now I wish I didn't pick that up. That was dumb. Mr. Barnes will only get in trouble going down this path. I need to find another way to get him a venomous tentacular. Exactly. I ain't giving him that one. I ain't gonna. What was that? Hey. Very nice. Very nice. Next, Given Rocks. Given Rocks is fun. Does it get any more cozy than Hogsmeade? It's pretty cozy. It is pretty cozy. Am I out of Hogsmeade yet? Can I fly yet? Come on. Yeah, man. Yes! Rebellio! Rebellio! Find all the stuff. Ooh, Castle. Must have been quite stately in its time. I bet it was quite nice in its time. Oh, it's, a little, it's more like buddies over there. More of those things. Another little bit of stuff. Uh, excuse me. Pardon me. Excuse, excuse, excuse me. Uh, uh. I just want just get uh, sir. Thank you. Sir, I went down. There's there's that. But, sir. Excuse me, pardon me. Okay. Let's get the hell out of here. Oh, the Hogsfield. Now where to find this is bottle? Uh I don't know. Let's go talk to this person. Lord of Beaumont should have returned by now. Oh. Had by dark wizards he was. You're not really holding that right. You know that? Excuse me, did you say something about Bardolf Beaumont? I did. I don't think we've met. I'm Dorothy Sprottle. 
I was just worrying about Claire Beaumont's brother, Bardolph. Only he's gone missing. Rumor is he was seen in the forest practicing dark magic. Saw him myself what? near some ruins with Rookwood's lot I did. Oh, I no. fear he got himself into trouble with the Ashwinders, especially if he made them a promise he couldn't keep. I'd help search for him myself, but no one will risk encountering Ranrock's loyalists. They seem to be everywhere. Apparently. I can certainly look out for him. Any help would be appreciated. You might speak to Claire first. Perhaps she has some insights that I don't. I can tell you that Bardolph was last seen in the forest wearing a particular woolen jumper. One mm. that Claire knitted herself. Oh, isn't that quite nice? Claire will be at her shop if you'd like to speak with her. Revelio. Yeah, I can go there. First, I'm gonna rob this place. Do 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 do. That. That. Y'all aren't gonna need it, right? Y'all are rich. Eat some food. There we go. What else we got here? Any other goodies? There's that thing. I want that this bag. looks intriguing. Very much so. Give me that. Pardon me. Excuse me. Take it. It's my hat now. All right. <laughs> Woo! We didn't jump over it. Brad. That's a big old skeleton head. Terrorized by Ranrock's loyalists. It's not right. Hello. I couldn't help but overhear. Did you mention Ranrock's loyalists? I did. I did. <sighs> Never imagined they'd act this deadly. I'm Claire Beaumont, by the way. Nice to meet you. Ranrock and his followers have set up camp here. No regard for our beloved hamlet or our livelihoods. Not right. Ruthless. My brother Bardolph dared to stand up to them and ended up in St. Mungo's. I'm simply at my wit's end. Hmm. What happened to your brother? How did your brother Bardolph end up in St. Mungo's? <sighs> Baldolf had spent the entire day handpicking herbs and roots for us. When a group of Ranrock's lot appeared and demanded the harvest for themselves, Baldolf refused. In their anger, they held him against a rock and robbed him. The moment he left St. Mungo's, he vowed revenge. I worry he may be dabbling in magic that he will one day regret. Dang. Okay, so that's what he's doing. You said Ranrock's loyalists have set up camp here. Where precisely? I'm gonna to go the kick south, some loyalists. Cross but... the river. Last I heard, there were several loyalists in each camp. I won't go near them. I will. I'm no. unfortunately quite familiar with Ranrock's loyalists. Perhaps I can do something. <sighs> Much as I would love to be rid of them, I wouldn't want you to risk injury or worse. Please be cautious. I'll do that. Don't worry about me. This is our home. Hey! It seems as though things are getting worse. Best be on my guard. We're gonna have fun. We're gonna go kick some loyalist keister. All right, loyalists. We've been terrorizing this side of business too long. Bring me a dozen tubes to the battle. I'll take them all. Run the other. One of Ranrock's camps. Exactly as Madame Beaumont described. Mm hmm. Hey, you, come here. Boom! 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 What are you shooting at? Flip <laughs> over. Get over. You sit down. <laughs> oh, shit. What are you waving at? Tell you, nice. Boom, bitch! <laughs> so bold? You get down. Here, try this on besides real quick. Woo! Kiss me, miss me, now you gotta kiss me. <laughs> Ow, you. You know what? Sit down. Bomb, bomb, bomb. You're no match for me. Uh, you missed. Do you want to do something? Want to do something? 
Run skis. On camp down, one more to go. I know, right? We're gonna have fun here. Ah, I'm on fire! Okay, I'm fine. We're gonna grab that. Is there anything in there? No. Anything else around? No. I know. Let's get in there. Let's get going. Enjoy suffering, do you? What? The wizards will be defeated. Oh, we. Whoa! What is that? That looks interesting. Come here. Good for you. Oh, I don't know where I threw that, but I threw that somewhere. Oh, 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 I will, will I? Blocked you. Blocked you. What are you going to do about it? I said sit down, punk. Both camps cleared. Madam Bono no, right? will be glad to hear that. Oh, yeah. I should be glad and super glad. I'm on fire. I'm amazing. This thing is pretty awesome, though. Like... What's it doing? Like, what's it doing? It's like a train thing. Can I get up there? I want up. I want to look at this thing. How do I? It's like a... a big old armored vehicle. That's for. Oh, it's a miner. It's a digger. Oh, interesting. Hey, chickens. Is there anything in here? Anything of value? These rocks have seen better days. Ooh, ooh, what is this? I found something. What is this? What, do, what did we find here, y'all? Ooh. I want that. Um, ooh. I want that too. Then. Um. Hey! Then I want that. That wasn't so difficult. Oh, that's cool. What? What I get? Collect ancient magic traces. That right, cool. Dang it! My gear is full. I don't want to pick anything up. Damn it! I'll have to come back. I'll have to come back. I'll have to come back. Ooh, I can sell to you and then pick that stuff up. Hello? See if there's something you need. Oh, I know you. Um, I don't need anything other than I need to sell stuff to you. Oh, I need that. Uh, sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that. Sell that, sell that, sell that, sell that, sell that. I mean, over 90, I'll sell it. Oh, my. That's been a pleasure. It has been. Lovely doing business with you. Now let's get in here and grab this stuff. Do, 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 I want you to, uh, 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 come on. Down! And go. Wait, hang on. Oh, that was a little bump. Anything here? 
Revelio. No, I just grab stuff from the other side of the wall. That's it. Jump down. You're young. You got good knees. You'd be fine. I'll take that. I'll take that. And we'll slide down. We'll grab that. Abandoned long ago, no doubt. What? Revelio. Probably that. All right, let's get moving. Boom. Now we got to go beat up these other dudes or go talk to somebody. Y'all are welcome, by the way, that I took out that encampment. Say thank you sometime, you know? Whoa, 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 whoa. Animals, animals, animals. What kind of animals do we got? And what are those things? Let me in close. Boom. Boom. And boom. It's a frog. Gross. I got one. There, there. Not going to hurt you. We're I ain't going to hurt you. I'm just going to rob you. I'm better than poachers because um, I don't hurt y'all. I mean, I still take you from your home and everything else, but at least I don't huh. hurt you. Now we can continue. I wanted a frog. I didn't have a frog. This is this is Pokemon for wizards. So I did it. I'm back. Man, you just play all night. Why don't you? I do miss the bustle of business. Poor customers afraid to venture. Hello, Madame Beaumont. Good news. I was able to clear out Ranrock's camps. You did. cleared them out. I did. How? Kick their ass. I just surprised them. I managed to catch them off guard. When my brother returns, this news will mean the world to him. You will saved it? our hamlet, my young friend. This will not be forgotten. I fear for other hamlets, truly. Ranrock and his lot are unlike any goblins I've ever seen. And hey, don't worry about it. Thank you for your time. I don't need I should be yours. going now. Thank you. But return to Claire Beaumont. Hang on. I didn't pick up a little box though. Wasn't I supposed to pick up a little box? Hang on. That's the one I'm supposed to be doing. What the hell was I doing? Hang on, I wasn't... I'm getting turned around, just doing side quests without even realizing. I just wanted to do this. You know, she helped us out. And then... And, and yeah. Hey, turn around. Hey, but I had other plans here. Oops. Hello. Hello, Mrs. Sprottle. Actually, Sirona Ryan asked if I'd come and see you. Dear Serona, a gem, has been for as long as I've known her. She thought you might need help collecting ingredients for your Wigamel potion. And she's correct. My darling Aiden used to collect hawk lumps for me. Since he died, my supply has dwindled. I'm sorry for your loss, Mrs. Brottle. Oh, thank you. Love of my life. A bit lost without him. If Aww. you wouldn't mind gathering some hawk clumps for me, I'd be happy to compensate you for your time. Oh, yeah. Believe it or not, I have some with me. Believe it or not, I have some with me. Oh, thank you. How wonderful. The traveling vendors will be thrilled to replenish their stock of Wigan Weld Potion. Sirona also mentioned that Mr. Sprottle was bringing her a box of letters when he fell ill. Indeed he was. I'd almost forgotten. 
I stumbled upon it just before Aiden died. He was hoping to go through it with Serona over a butterbeer or two. Uh, those two were always like two bow truckles in a branch. Aww. Aiden took ill when he was collecting hawk clumps on his way to see her. He made it home, but I fear he dropped the box in the cavern. The cavern is in the hills just southwest of our hamlet. You can gather hawk clumps and collect the box of letters there. Sure, that works. Sorona said she lived with you during the summers when she was at Hogwarts. What was she like? Oh, uh, goodness. Well, she was almost exactly like she is now. Charming, good head on her shoulders, taking care of everyone. That's good. I can't tell you the fun we had when she and her friends would visit us during the year, all buzzing about practicing charms. Talented group. Her friend Mirabelle was a genius in the garden. Learned it all from her muggle parents, if you can believe it. I believe it. They're, they're, I mean, farmers are awesome. Thank you, Mrs. Brottle. Thank you. I'll be here if you are able to collect those hawk clumps. I and the vendors I help would greatly appreciate it. Super appreciate it. No worries. No worries. Get all the fun stuff. Let's go. All right. That's what I wanted. When I, oh, there's more there's people down there, huh? Right. Revelio. This must be the cavern Mrs. Brottle mentioned. It is. Must be. The Ministry ought to loosen the reins on the dark art. No better protection, if you ask me. Akio. I don't. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I won't go down as easy. <laughs> Wait, did he like fall down and die? Hang on. Get back here, oh, no! <laughs> uh, uh, smack. Akio. Woo! Also. Boom. <laughs> fall down. Splat. <laughs> Where are you going? That was freaking funny. What was that? What was what? <laughs> have fun with that and have a good fall. Blah. <laughs> That's how you take out dark people. Coward my ass. Oh, have fun with that. Shoot. <laughs> Ah, uh, I fell down. I was having too much fun <laughs> doing that to them. But then I finally just took the step off and was like, whoop, blap. Ah, uh, man, I was having too much fun. I wasn't paying attention. This must be the cavern Mrs. Brussel mentioned. Then I did it to myself. All right, let's, 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 let's correct that. Oh. Protego! Oh, Protego, huh? Protego? How about Accio? Oh. Well, whatever. See, that's Your how it was supposed days to go. Are over. I know, right? Oh, poaching? Hang on. Hang on, hang on. That's what I was trying to do earlier. Where I fell down my death. Poaching? I know. Do they have animals? Alright. <gasps> Got that. Uh, that. And that. Coaching, coaching. So, do they have animals or no? No. They didn't have animals. I got excited because I could have freed the animals. At least. Well, at least it's cleared out. At least it's cleared out. That was a fun way to do it, too. The hall clumps to Mrs. Sprottle, but I still need to visit the cave to find. Let's have a look around, see if I can find that box of letters. That's all the hall clumps for now. Mrs. Sprottle should be pleased. I know, I got a ton of them. Revelio. Anything in there? Fish. Good for you. This splash have been taken up there. Up there. Oh. 
Have the fire pull back your crap. And jump. Rat, let's get in here. There's a box in here, huh? What was that noise? Rebellion. Ah. This looks like it used to contain something ginormous and big. Yeah. Battle time? I think it's battle time, guys. About to be battle time. Revelio. Revelio. Nothing. Down, down we go. Either I'll have to fight that troll. Yeah, we're gonna fight him. That doesn't do anything. Boom! 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 Freeze! Boom! I dodged that. I try to block it. What well, kind of block it? Hey, hang on to that. Boy. There we go. Rest easy, my large friend. Yep, rest easy, my large friend. I probably should have like the disarm spell up, you know, so I can disarm them. While I'm out and about, you know. Let's see here. So I have that one, that one. Oh, I do have the disarm one. I just have to be like that. Spelliamus. I'm just dumb. Hello, what's in here? Oh, me. I'll go there always. Oh, I'm gonna look this way. Real quick. I think Rebellion. that's the way I'm supposed to go. Ooh, all kinds of stuff right here. We got some squirrels. Good for you. Ow. Me all that and that and that. Boom. All right, before we go that way, because that's the way we need to go, I want to see what's over here. I found a secret. I want to go check out the secret. Lumos. Lumos. Army, excuse me, get the hell out of the way, vines. More secrets. Oh, wait. I get Revelio. Expelliarmus. Lumos. Ah, eh, whatever. I got something. Mo. Mo. I think we're getting close to the spot. This must be Serona's box of letters. Happy birthday, my dear friend. I sneaked in the kitchens and asked Finky to make your favorite 
Green Crowdy. She was lad of black. Not sure where she got raspberry, uh, raspberries at this time of year. Genius that, Finky. I love Finky. Finky's awesome. Uh, I conjured this wee gift of you, uh, for you as a token of my gratitude. And stood your ground on my back during Quidditch last week. I might have left that team all together. And now we've won the Quidditch Cup. Woohoo! Very nice. Oop, there's another one. There we go. I should take this box of letters to Sorona. Should be glad. I think that's everything. That is. That's everything. I got it. Got all the letters and all kinds of fun stuff. Alright. We're going to and we're gonna fly or we're gonna warp rather uh hogs mead and boom yes yeah, so i gotta find out that sneak oh, other sneaky one i ain't stealing on. anything we don't steal stuff all right i mean we might borrow things but... got your stuff Hello, Sorona. I have good news. I was able to provide your friend Mrs. Sprottle with some hall clumps for her Wigamel potion, and I found your box of letters. Oh, thank you. I knew you were the one to ask. I'm glad I could be of help. Mrs. Sprottle sends her best. Don't know what I'd have done without her and Aiden. Thank you, again, for helping her. And for returning this box of letters. It's nice to reflect on good memories. Yes, it is. Yes, it does. Is it? Yeah. It does, yeah. All right. So we got that. Um. So we have... Discover what happened to... I can go do that real quick. Then... Also at Hogwarts. Don't worry, we're, we're gonna get to the main one. Not, not gonna worry, we're gonna get to the main one. Oh, wait, we do need a... Your head sometimes, I swear! Alright. Nope, nope, nope. See, that one's better. Then we did get the new hat. Stinky, oh, don't need it. Then that guy. Let's go sell some stuff and buy some stuff all at the same time. Where did I come out from? I came out there, so I can go this way. Excuse me, sir. I need some more of your, Take your time uh, looking about. Plenty of wonderful books to stoke a curious mind like yours. I know. Very curious mind. Okay, let's see what we got. So we can get a chopping station spell crop. The ability to conjure a chopping station. This station produces pro pr produce. Periodic produces a plant byproduct. So keep an eye on it. Ooh. Okay, cool. That's the dung one. That unlocked the ability to conjure a hopping pot. This type of magical little pot. We periodically brew a random selected potion. So that's pretty awesome. To a refiner spellcraft. Unlock the ability to conjure a material refiner. I uh, used to produce moonstone essential for additional conjuring spellcraft. That's actually not too bad. I think these are all the other ones are just pot stuff. And potion stuff. Oh, it's a D-shaped potion station. Unlocks the ability to conjure a T-shaped potion station. Perfectly suited to all of your potion brewing needs.
And that can't be. Where was the chopping station? Hmm. Go ahead and grab that. Nothing like finding just the right thing, is there? Yeah, we're gonna grab that. And... Let me know if there's anything else I can do to help. Will do, will do. I think I need to learn other, like, potion things. Let's go over here. Uh, potion, potion, potion. I believe it's out of here. Yes. Pippins, potions. Which well, break? Do let me know if I can be of any assistance at all. Thank you again for delivering those potions to Madame Lawing. No Save me a lot of time and trouble. Visibility potion. Recipe for a powerful damage potion. And recipe for a potion that reduces the drinker's spell cooldowns. That could be pretty handy. Yeah, let's grab that. A wise decision. Thank you. You're welcome. Now I can grab I can craft those things. Alright. Alright, y'all. Okay, okay, okay. I know I wasted a bunch of time there. I know I wasted time. Um, so let's go to I think it's Hogs Warps. Uh, quests while I'm looking there. Let's go turn this sucker in. Um, uh, map. Um, oh, it's not on Hogwarts. World map. Oh, it's way up, way up there. Ooh. Wait. Hang on. Which one? What is this? What am I doing? Nice to see you, my oh. brother's keeper. Discover what happened to brothers. Elmont. Yeah. I'll do that real quick. And after this, then we're gonna go knock out the main one. The other ones can wait. Cause I'm kind of already invested in what's going on with the Balmonts. Balmonts. Rebellion. There we go. the river near the forest. I must be on the right track. Yep. Uh-oh. What happened here? I should investigate. Accio. Incendio. Depulsa. We'll have fun with that. Oh! <laughs> Hang on to that for a minute. Here we go. Is that inferior? To know what really happened to him. Wait, what happened to him? Oh, I think he died. It's here. Come on. Let me say. It's here. Oh, it's those birds. Revelio. What else is here, real quick, before we, you know, get battle? I think he was playing some dark magic and uh, summoned some baddies and uh, did some baddie things. I think he did some baddie, baddie things. Wait, what is the.
Damn. This mentions in theory, and something about it being Bardolf's turn next. Oh, dang. All right, let's get going. Hang on, what, was, what is this that I'm... This could prove dangerous if I'm not careful. Let's go. Yeah. yeah. Revelio. Everybody acts like it's so far away. It's actually not. Not far away at all. Don't be a wuss. Let's go turn in this stuff. You've made up a Hogsfield safer. Madam Beaumont, I believe I have some news of your brother. Father? Do. What do you know of my brother? He's dead. I regret to say that Bardolf had been turned into an Inferius, and I had to kill him. What? But, but how could you possibly think that an Inferius was my brother Bardolf? That's I know, absurd. right? He was wearing a woolen jumper. And knitted. No, no, this can't be. Oh, oh. damn. I'm truly sorry. I wish it had been better news. I wish you well, Madam Beaumont. What more could I have done? Oh, oh damn. Bardolf. Bringing that bad news. About that bad news. Hello, Homura. I guess I'll just go rob the place, make myself feel better real quick. I mean, I didn't have really have a choice. It's not like I'm gonna let that like be, you know, in case you know. I don't know. Other bad people or other like innocent people walk by that weren't as you know badass and powerful as I am. They could have got hurt. Fine now, dummy guys. Ooh. Uh, give me that. What? Black. Huh. On one there. How? Why was that door unlocked? Rebellion. Find me. Oh, I was like, there. Ha there was a chest in here. Right, let's head over this direction. Well, we had to we had to tell her what happened. You know, I mean, it's not like we're we should have lied. She would have been like, maybe one day he'll return and all this other stuff. I'm like, no, I'm sorry, he's never gonna return. It, I should have done more. Gone. I love her more. Now she's all bent out of shape. So bad. I feel bad. I feel super bad. Revelio. I mean, I could have. There's not much. I, I mean, I had to do it. It's like I, didn't, I couldn't have done it. I, didn't, I had to do it. If anything was self defense. I am just messy. I like that roof. That roof. Very nice. Gonna grab that. And then what's in here? That. Rebellion. Up here we go. from up here. About... Oh. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. How do 
I get but down here? Maybe sometimes you gotta go up. Go down. Um, I didn't do that. Funny. Excuse me. Out the way. Let's see what I did real quick. Can I just drop this down here? All right. Well, that's that. Yeah, we did all that. We did all that. We did all that. So now, um, quests actually is what we need. Let's just go ahead and what is that? Oh, that's why I have to go get that plant thing. Unlock. Go talk to her. Okay. Now we're gonna go actually do the main story, y'all. We're gonna go actually go do the main quest. Get it on the map. Way over here. Which we have been to already ish, kind of. Sometimes the side stories, side to side quests, to in there. are uh, sad. Revelio. <laughs> Pop it. Hope you're having fun down there. Ooh. This place is like a fort or something. A privet of dying, are we? What? Rebellion. Who said that? Rude. Oh, is that like a big chest? Yes. Come here. I'll take it. Who puts a chest? You know what? What else? Ooh, let me do this. Hey, Sebastian, I'm here. I'm here, Sebastian. Sebastian, I'm here. Sebastian. Sebastian. Not here. I guess I'll wait for him. I'll wait for him. Hey, there you, you are. It. I did. You weren't here. I, I was waiting on you. Enjoying the view. Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there. Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it, even after Anne was cursed by one of them. Possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us. Which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. <laughs> I'm hoping yeah. a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anne I used to know. Come on, I'll take you to my uncle's. Let's do this. This way. Following you. Let's go. On your back. Move. Aha! Feldcroft used to be a lot livelier. Oh, yeah? With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. Here we are. My sister should be just inside. It's a nice little hovel. I like it. Hello, Sebastian sister. My name's Cowpoke. Aha! Sebastian, where did you? Is that what I think it is? We've been over this, boy. Hey. Shrivel figs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. Damn. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure. When will you accept that? Never. I can never accept it. <laughs> 
Now look what you've done. What, what he did? I'm sorry. Damn. No, Spash, we're gonna I'm help sorry you. Sorry, you had to see that. All right. If you don't mind, I just need a moment alone. It's fine. It's fine. Poor Sebastian. Not the visit he hoped for. I don't know, right? I'm gonna go sell some stuff. You take your I'm take five. Worry. I'll be right back, Sebastian. Don't worry about it. Don't Hello. worry about it. Nice to meet you. Welcome. I'm Howdy. Bernard Indiaye, and this Howdy. is my shop. Is there anything I can help you with? Well, let's let's see. I want to see what you got. I want to see what, what you are we got. in the market for today? Ooh, you got some stuff. You know what? I'm actually growing these in my. Oh shit! I gotta go check on those. Uh, they're probably good. I'm not here to buy anything. I'm just here to sell. Just here to sell. Oh. I... Where? There you go. Off you. Thank, uh, thanks for the patronage. Thank you for your patronage. Rebellion. Love that. All right, Sebastian. You... Okay, I gave you your space. That boy will fray my last nerve. Oh, I'm going to kick Excuse me, Mr. Sallow. Oh, yes. Sebastian's friend. Yes. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. He thinks he can help Anne, oh, but nothing can be done for her. Mm. It could be that you've not yet discovered the cure. Ah, you sound like Sebastian, thinking you know better than the healers at St. Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne, and the goblins aren't likely to explain themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the loyalist's way. I hope uh, hope could be a good thing. Mm. With all due respect, sir, hope could keep Anne's spirits up. You may mean well, but I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children, especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. I hope you'll remember what I've said. Good day. Good day to you too, sir. Right. Bastard, ruthless, mean, jeez. Rebellion. Practice dummies. Hey, people, you want to see something cool? Send them. Check that out. Wasn't that badass? It was awesome, wasn't it? You're jealous. I know it. Uh, hi, Sorry Sebastian. About earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. Are you all right, Anne? I didn't mean to intrude. You didn't, truly. <laughs> and I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts, and often suddenly, it's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh dear, Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. As she is. And she knows how to keep students like my brother and me in line. I do miss Hogwarts, but I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft really if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cozy retreat it once was. Sebastian nah. mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-aura but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. They both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. 
I'll do my best. I can promise to speak with him about it. Thank you. His search for a cure was that. futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting no, we're gonna tired. Find one. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. You're more than welcome. We're I wish you one. well. I ought to see how Sebastian's faring. Take that. Read that later. Don't worry. We're gonna find a cure because I'm stubborn too. We're gonna do this. We're gonna do well, this. Come on, Sebastian. Listen to me. She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first hand glance of what I'm dealing with. I did. I apologize for my uncle. It's fine. I'll admit, I wasn't expecting him to be so angry. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son, as if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my <laughs> sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with me. I need to show you where it happened. I can do that. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. I know. And I have ancient power. We're going All to... All the debris you'll see is from whatever's going on at that abandoned estate. Mm -hmm. They've been digging for something. I wonder what they're digging for. Up there, on that plateau, mm -hmm. is where they cursed Anne. Like, this way. They're just like, like I'm going to curse you because they're just is there a killer. Are they like testing out some How new spells? Are we expected to dig through this rubble. Ramrock knows what he's doing. It's an honor to be a part of it. A good wizard is a dead wizard in my life. Come on, come on. Give me that. Hey, Buckweights. I got a bone to pick with you. Hey, Sebastian. Don't you love like did that to you? Go <laughs> from bone. Oh! Incendio. Oh, you want to go? Okay, okay, hang on. Back off. Back off. I think it's hilarious. Come on, Sebastian. You've made your last mistake. Oh, I did, did I? You will suffer. Boom! 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 Shut up! Oh, you want to go? Oh, got more? Oh, shit. I confess, that was a bit more than I'd bargained for. I tried to warn you. Oh, I'm fine. That was awesome. Revelio. All right. Um, I'm going to try to fix that. Ugh. Go around. Okay, we're gonna go this way. All right, Spanish. Why are you being sneaky? Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. 
Yeah, I know, right? This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting from the estate. Before yeah. my uncle and I could stop her, Anne rushed out, racing towards the fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. Mm -hmm. It may be grasping at Billywigs, but I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to whoever cursed Anne. Might be the only way to learn what type of magic harmed her, which could help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And Agreed. at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? Yes. We're gonna they do this, guys. They seem to have set up camp here for a specific reason. Revelia. They have stations for everything. Well, what is this? Whose home was this? A bit abandoned long since I've lived here. Rumor was a Hogwarts professor lived here once, centuries <gasps> ago. But that's all I ever heard. <gasps> I think it's one of, I think we know who. You have an idea of which one. I've heard that goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. It's a wonder the ministry isn't doing more. Revelio. Because they're in cahoots. Always armed and ready for a fight, Ranrock's loyalists. So this was a homestead of one of the big powerful wizards that we this well on. looks familiar it does doesn't it sebastian i've seen this before this house the well the view what do you mean yes well, give me a moment i'll explain in a second <gasps> it is just that that's the hill i think that's the hill or that's the hill yeah you can't see my finger that i'm pointing at the screen but yeah, this is where they like rescued all the stuff. Revenue. Oh my goody old aunt. This is amazing. This game is so cool. It's so awesome. It's so fun. I want all this stuff. I'm going to rob these loyalists first. Take that. Rob you. Take that. And, 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 and yeah stuff okay we need to get in there i wonder who's gonna be in this painting sebastian over here do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed could be but it looks to me as though this was intentional i know right A little bit intentional. Hmm. Sebastian, this house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you- I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. There was a little girl and a drought. The keepers have shown me other memories as well. Mm -hmm. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganock. She was one of the Keepers. The Keepers? Like in Quidditch? And you found a pensive in the library? I'm not following you. I realize it's <laughs> a lot to take in. I'm it not is. even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves Keepers because they're protecting some type of knowledge. It has to do with the vault at Gringotts. Let me see if I've got this straight. You have Ranrock and Rookwood after you because of something you found at Gringotts where you ended up via a port key. You can see traces of an ancient magic that you think Ranrock is trying to harness. And now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Yes. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. <laughs> if I didn't know you, 
I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the keepers. Let's, Let's keep this. searching. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? Only one way to find out. A bed? A lot of hay in that bed. Oh, what's down here? Hello. Why bother blocking a stairway? Lumos. There might be something here worth a closer look. They've left all of this simply strewn about. Tells me they're after something bigger. Seems hmm. these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. A journal entry of Isadora's. I should hold on to this. Mm hmm. Revelio. I think I need to use that poof one. That worked. Lumos. You're not going to believe this. Hey. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. No. The Undercroft. Right there. Awesome. I know it sounds strange, but honestly. I Nothing you say sounds strange to me anymore. Fair enough. I can see the Undercroft through this stone wall as though it's a window. This has happened before. I'm listening. I think it's to do with my ability to see traces of ancient magic. But you said you didn't really understand it and that you couldn't wield it. That's true. And I'm still not sure what it all means. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be flawed. We can. But perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now. Even Ominous. Understood. <laughs> well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway. Here we come. Let's go. I'm tempted to hold my breath. Let's go to the Undercroft. Very interesting. <laughs> I must be floored. Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. How'd you not see that earlier? What's all that stuff moving for? Oh, damn. Why hide a triptych here? Seems as if something's missing. A Portrait. Note. Let's have a look. Mm -hmm. Very interesting. Anything helpful in the notes? Uh. A rune symbol. I've seen similar symbols used by the keepers. I've been yeah. thinking. A keeper lived in that house centuries ago, and Ranrock and his lot have been searching there. You said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I can't be sure, of course, but I don't think so. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. Hmm. Very well. But that doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. 
then we'll have to unravel what this all means. Yep. But now I need to see Ominous. Don't worry, I won't tell him anything. Did I mention that, apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here, in Hogwarts? You did not? Sounds worth looking into. Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. <laughs> but I'm glad you told me everything you did. You're welcome. I'll be in touch. Till then. Till then. Well, there we go, guys. We just did... So, we learned a ton of stuff about Sebastian, but we also found out that this little spot has a uh, uh, secret stuff. And I think Ominous, you know, he's blind, he's gonna be like, hey, there's supposed to be a wall here, what the hell? Be like, Meet me near the ruins of Falbatton Castle. After dark, do not tell anyone. Okay. Sure, why not? Why not, why not, why not? First, let's head up over here, but oh, we learned a bunch there, which is awesome. This place is cool. Um, we need to go here, then here, real quick. They're in there. Hey, Deke! What's up? I'm back. Just, you know, adventuring. Being a student. Learning all kinds of fun, crazy things. Fun, crazy things. Hi guys! How's it going? Y'all doing good? Oh, up, oh, up, oh, we need to give you some, some brushes. Here you go. Uh, you need some brushes too? Brush. There you go. Collect. 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 There we go. Here we go. There you go. And I think that's all of them. Oh! How about a toy for y'all, huh? There you go. Place is cool. I love it. Alright. Now, I mean, I did get... Hang on. Need to kapoofy things. Uh, put that there. Map there real quick. And I got. Aha! Chopping things. Scientific. So this is a chopping station. I like that one. All right, now where to stick you? Hmm. Maybe over in here somewhere? Look right there. Well. Oh, it just like chops away. Okay. Gotta grab all those things. Gotta make sure we continue greeting these things. Seen this many plants here before. Not here. There we go. Um. Uh, 
so many plants, Deke. So many plants. Uh, oh, is this the one I'm wearing? Yes. Alright, let's upgrade. Oh. Can we upgrade this too? Okay. Can we upgrade this? Yes. Can we upgrade this? Yes. Can we upgrade this? Yes. And can we upgrade this? No. Well, there we go. We did some upgrades. Four, three, two, one. Dunskis. Alrighty then. We got some. We uh, finally upgraded everything. Maybe I'll finally get that stuff like off my back. Um, that's worse. All right, we did get the new. Oh, that is slick. I still like that better. Still like that best. Then uh, we already got a pretty good one. So let's go to quests. So we have two main quests. We have one that we would learn when Gaudium of Yosa, which I already have. I already have that spell. Why am I learning it again? I don't know. And this one is a tin astronomy class. Mm. Then we have all these other ones. It's going. going. Eh. Eh. Yeah. Okay. Well, how about let's do one more one. Let's go attend astronomy class. You know what? Let's go attend astronomy class. I think that'll be good, guys. I think that will be pretty solid right there. So first off, let's select there and then oh my gosh look at all those side quests you know side quests for days guys side quests for days all right revelio revelio it's about to be halloween or something where's all the pokeball <laughs> pokeballs uh jack-o-lanterns are out There was also some side quests over here. Ah, here there is. Hey, you. Adelaide Oaks, isn't it? Oh. I received your yeah. owl. Yes, I'm Adelaide Oaks. Hi. Oh, dear. You see, my uncle Roland is a metal trader who's quite well known in the goblin community. He normally sends me owls every week when he's on his business travels. In his last owl, he alluded to dealings with those radical goblins, Ugh. Ranrock's loyalists. It's been ages since that owl and I'm worried. What with the troll attack on Hogsmeade and the rumors that goblins may have been involved, well, I'm fearing the worst. Should I be worried about my uncle, or am I overthinking this? Mm. I don't want to put her, like, in a worrisome state, but I'll still check into it. I'm not convinced you need to worry. Perhaps your uncle's been delayed, and surely he can take care of himself. That's exactly what Professor Weasley said when she forbade me from leaving the grounds to look for him. She's convinced he can handle himself, but I can't concentrate on anything until I know he's all right. I... Uh, could you try to find out for me? From what I hear, you're almost as adventurous as Uncle Roland. <laughs> you know what? Sure. I'll try and look into it for you, Adelaide. Thank you. He's very thorough in his record keeping, notes all his trades in a journal, makes maps. In fact, in his last owl, he drew me a map of his next stop. He planned to set up camp north of here. I do hope you're able to find out where he is. Thank you again for any help you can provide. Sure. Not a problem. Not a problem, but that's not what I'm going to go do right now. Nope, we're not doing that. We're going to astronomy class. Astronomy class. That's where we're going. Astronomy class. Astronomy class. Because we're going to go look at stars and stuff, guys. Because why not? Up we go. Your own. I hope Adelaide's Uncle Roland is all right. I'm sure he's fine. seems very worried. He does. Adelaide mentioned our uncle's camp may be near Brockborough, past the yeah. river. Yep. That's for another day. That's for another day. 
Do 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 do. Oh, come on. Rip that. Do 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 do. Rebellion. 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 my own blue. Oh, can I get in here now? I'm not looking forward at all. Yes! Hello, Hamora. There we go. We done got it, y'all. Oh, there's a kitty cat. Hi, kitty cat. Who room is this? Oh, looks like we're getting another locked. There we go. All this, all these locks and stuff, and it's just Rebellion. junk. Hey, kitty cat. Bye, kitty cat. Y'all saw nothing. I was not in there. Eh, I'll grab those later. I'll grab that later. We got. We're late for class. We're late for class. Gotta go. Gotta go. Gotta go. 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 Gosh, why is astronomy class way up here in the tower? Hi, Sir Nicholas. I guess because it it, li it likes to see things. Handy resource indeed, your field guide. Your and field guide. Needs to be included. You're welcome. All right, now okay, I think this is our first astronomy class, guys. Hell yeah. And your reading is the dragon. That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. <laughs> Perhaps. Um, I guess I'll sit here. Howdy. How's it going? Ladies. Professor Shah. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight, we will be on the observation deck. Ooh, that'd be fun. Do some stargazing. That's probably why it's up in the tower. <laughs> a little cold. Still don't have your own? You can't no. be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar. Sure. Yeah, he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Go for it. Here, I can adjust that for no, you. No, no. Bring it into focus on your own. <laughs> but he's like, I want to do this. Why do I have to share my own stuff? Oh, dang. That's kind of cool. Oh, that's cool. Now, I expect all of you to put in your stargazing hours outside of class. Is that clear? But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very selfsame stars above us. Is that clear? <laughs> Everyone's freezing. I'm like, yeah. Dismissed. Even I, it's like, I have a, I have like, I have a big old coat on and everything. Hello. I'm still freezing. I don't believe we've met officially. I'm Amit. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Hello, Amit. Hi. It's nice to meet you. Did I hear Professor Shaw say that you don't have your own telescope? Correct. I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. That would be awesome. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. Sure. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. Goblin cut glass, first-rate optical enchantments. Hate to think such a fine instrument is just collecting dust. 
Well, I, I thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Mm -hmm. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some uh, reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards. Sir, sure, reading. Bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Yeah, I, we can do that. We can do that. We can do that. Um, thank you again. You're super. You're a super nice guy. Super nice guy. It's freezing out there. I hate the cold. Cold's just horrible. Don't like it. Aren't I supposed to go like down? I need. Just, wait. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. What? Oh, here. I didn't know there was something there. Yeah. Ooh. Take that. The girls, I lit, uh, I, lit, I lit some fire. Come down here and warm up. Yeah. This was his old telescope. <laughs> Looks practically brand new. Ah, it does. A pristine night for stargazing. Do be... not let it be That's wasted. Ah, oh, no, 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 no. All right, so now let's go down here. I got that. All right, my friend. The What's up? perfect night for... Oh, hello again. Hello? I have the telescope. It's nicer than I'd expected. I would not offer a prospective stargazer a third-rate lunoscope. <laughs> 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 but there is, um, something else. Yes. yes. What is it? What is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It yeah. just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. There is. I believe Sorry. we could use it to find hidden constellations. Hmm. No, no. And you need someone to help find it. I do. Are you in? <laughs> no one from the Gobstones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Let us get moving while the stars are still out. <laughs> they are I'll cowards. show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. Sure. Sounds exciting. No I'm in. To convince me. Let's get going. Brilliant. Let's you do won't this. regret it. Shall nah, we? I won't regret it at all. Let's go do it. I'm not going to get jumped, am I? I'm going to tell you, I'm pretty powerful. The table is on a castle wall ahead. Look for a stone platform. Something that doesn't quite belong. We'll know There's... it when we see it. Onwards we go. Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs for ritual stargazing. You know, there, one, there is one actually in uh, Hogwarts. It is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Happy to be here. It Happy is to good be to here. the glass from now and then. It is. Lumos. I can do it's that too, you know. It's not creepy out here at night, is it? No. Nah. The Gobstones Club are cowards. Here I am, charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? If you're sure. <laughs> Hang on. Didn't realize my uh, thing dying. Didn't yell at. <laughs> Got yelled at, y'all. Here we go. Sure. Onwards and onwards. That's how that saying goes. Hmm. A little foreboding. A what? few cobwebs and some dust. Nothing to be concerned about. And human oh, cages. Course. It's just not as tidy as I expected. Incendio. about that first knickers Lumos. Ah, we did it the same time ooh like that old castle walls Incendio. Lumos. more cobwebs you don't yep. think any spiders might be lurking about oh no. nah Look, not this close to school table. meat I think you should do the honors. Go on, <laughs> try it out. All right, let's try it out. The constellation Ooh. should appear near the center of your view. Seize it. Okay. 
As soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Got it. Ooh. Lyra. I was right about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars, just as the book said. And your contribution was invaluable. Rest assured, you shall be credited in my memoirs one day. <laughs> well, thank you. Thank you, Amit. I look forward to reading them. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> this is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest, all beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my hmm. old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Thank you. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, <laughs> you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Um, anyway, glad our adventure was a success. <laughs> I will see you soon. Well, that was actually kind of cool and kind of fun. Got a, got a new friend and, uh, yeah, we we learned we saw like found constellations and stuff. Ah, <sighs> never do get tired of seeing the astronomy tower at night. What a view! What? Ah, oh, that is pretty cool. That is actually a pretty cool, pretty cool tower. You know what? I might go up there and fly up there. You'll have fun. I meet. I'm gonna fly up here. Do, 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 do. What? I can't enter? Fine, whatever. All right. Well, that knocked out that guy. Now let's speak with Sebastian and Ominous. Ooh. Mm. Yeah, let's go do it. Let's go do it. Let's go speak with them. We have to go speak with them, so let's go speak with them. Let's go, let's go, let's go have a chat. We're gonna have a chat. We're gonna have a chat. Why can't I warp there yet? I got a new telescope. Man, I'm getting a lot. Uh, I'm getting a lot of cool things. All the cool things. Right. Revelio. It's Revelio. I don't want Revelio. I'm going to go this way. Ominous. We're going to have a chat. You and me. Buddy to buddy. Mono to mono to. Well, actually, no. Sebastian's going to be there. It is pretty cool that all that, like, they're doing seasonal changes and stuff. That is really cool. So as you progress through the game, the season changes just like they do and everything else. That's awesome. Really, really, really cool. It's going to get winter here, and that's going to look super cool, I bet. Hey. Oh, my. This is cool. They have, like, bats and all mirages and stuff. That is cool. Cool. I like that. Look at all that food. That really? Something's kind of been touched. Who leaves their eggs? What a freaking feast. What a freaking feast. It's amazing. Anything to do with the dark heart should be avoided. It's too risky. Anything to do with Salazar Slytherin is worth the risk. Oh, damn. I can't agree. And I'll not say a word more. I'm sorry. I Jeez. won't give up. What were you and Omina speaking about? He's being ridiculous. Apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. Omina swears it was used for the Dark Arts, so he wants nothing to do with it. Hmm. I reminded him that Anne needs a cure. This scriptorium could hold the answers we need. Ominous is right. Meddling in the dark arts is dangerous. There's more to dark magic than people realize. The Gaunts know this better than most. Perhaps I've spoken out of turn. Ominous's family history is personal to him. I bet. Mm. I'd like to know more about it if you wouldn't mind telling me. I won't repeat it. Very well. But do keep this between us. I will. Ominous learned dark magic from his parents. Are you familiar with the Cruciatus Curse? No, I'm not. What does the Cruciatus Curse do? It's known as the Torture Curse. 
Crucio. It huh. inflicts intense, excruciating pain on the victim. Yeah. Apparently, his parents and older siblings had no qualms about casting us on muggles for sport. Ominous described Jeez. the sound of the victim's cries as horrific, so the first time he was asked to cast it himself as a child, he couldn't bring himself to do it. As punishment, his family cast it on him. The anguish was so bad that when asked to cast it again, he relented. I have repeatedly assured Ominous that he did what he had to, but he still hasn't forgiven himself. You really didn't have a choice. How horrible. Poor Ominous. He was only a child. He shouldn't blame himself. After that incident, the rift between Rift. Ominous and his family only grew. That is until I came along. Every moment he isn't at Hogwarts, he's with us in Feldcroft. Ominous trusts me. And more often than not, he winds up listening to me. I'll remind <laughs> him of that when I follow up about the scriptorium. Watch for my owl. I'll have news soon enough. Sounds good. Sounds good. Sounds like a good I'll plan. make Ominous what? understand. He'll change his mind. But it's still bad stuff to go, you know, mess around in the dark arts, man. It's not it's not a good thing. It's a very, very bad thing. I didn't know this room was here. Hello, Amora. What's in here? Got it. Got it. Why this is all here? Good for you. Hmm. Hmm. Pretty interesting. I don't know. Maybe it's like a like a guard tower or something. So like archers would sit up there and protect people or something. Who knows? Down no, no. out down out but now we can at least warp here now because we have that picked up and we have all those together and yeah all right y'all ooh, 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 there's a couple things the great hall ceiling we know it's a, it's it's a spell we get that it's a spell ow can i do something with this Hello, people. Welcome to Hogwarts. I hope you have had a grand time. Feast and eat. That's how it works. Wasn't there a door back over here? I thought there was a door over here. Doesn't look like there's a door over here. There's no doors. This is just, you know, the grand hall. For a place this big... Alohomora. It's real. This room's really not... I guess this school doesn't have that many, uh... There it is. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. There we go. Got it. Got it. Yeah, that was a little trickier than I was. Working. Hey, I need that. Fine now, damn you guys. Got it. I got more of the moon things. I got two of them so far. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Anyways, y'all, I think that's going to wrap it up for today's ride. So before we like call it right there, let's head back up to our amazing, beautiful room. Say goodbye to our great pets and uh, drop off some stuff and then uh, expect some stuff and grab some stuff and do some stuff. All the stuffs. Right, Deke? Right, Deke. Deke's awesome. Ooh, elegant casual uniform. I'm gonna have to check that out. Hi guys, how's it going? Not doing good. Ooh, we're about to collect. Very nice. Glad that y'all are doing great. I need to, to to put these things back on. I can give y'all's intentions. We have 31 more minutes. How's the lovely Hippogriff doing? Very pretty. Yeah, you're so elegant and so amazing and so powerful and strong and... Don't climb out, claw my eyes out, please. I think 
like every day or these periodically grow back or something? something. Yeah, I guess. Yeah, they grow back. Stuff grows back. Things just grow back. Anyways, y'all, I hope y'all had a blast today. We learned a lot of more stuff, a lot of new things, a lot of amazing, great things. And uh, this is this has just been a blast. Absolute blast. And uh, yeah, I'm going to start collecting these things. So I will catch you all on the next ride. I hope you had fun again. And uh, yeah.